Good day, gents. Welcome again. In this video, you can see maintenance of boiler burners. For safety, switch off burner combustion and tag man on work. Prepare suitable chain block with sling wire to lift up main burner. As first, loosen retaining bolt of flame eye sensor and remove it. Disconnect fuel oil inlet coupler of pilot burner. And then, disconnect cat plugs of electrodes. To remove pilot burner from baffle plate, loosen and remove butterfly nuts as first. Pull out pilot burner from its pocket and keep it safe place. This is pilot burner assembly of boiler. Maker of this boiler is Muir and model is HB15T. Okay, let's prepare to pull out main burner from its guide. Disconnect fuel inlet coupler for main burner. Disconnect compressed air inlet pipe to main burner. And then, disconnect steam inlet pipe to main burner. To lift out main burner from guide, loosen hexagonal socket set bolts on top of guide pipe. Now, main burner is ready to pull out from guide. By using chain block and sling wire, gradually pull out burner nozzle pipe. Let's disassemble and take measurement for main burner. Firstly, place burner nozzle pipe on vise with soft jaws. Loosen and remove three lock screws on ferrule. After then, loosen and remove ferrule and nozzle from pipe. Remove check valve from socket. Check valve is important part of burner to prevent oil dripping after combustion stopped. To remove cap from mixer, loosen and remove lock screws on cap. Now, can detach cap from mixer. This is burner cap with atomization holes.
Loosen lock screws on mixer to remove ferrule. And then, remove ferrule from mixer. You can see nozzle inside of mixer. These are important parts of main burners. To disassemble check valve, remove circlip as first. After then, pull out all parts from valve housing. Clean all disassembled parts of burner with light oil. Before reassemble, clean parts with compressed air. Insert valve into housing. And then, mount spring with screen plate. Fix circlip in position. Now check valve is ready for service. Let's reassemble main burner. Mount ferrule on pipe and tighten. And then, fix three lock screws and tighten. Mount check valve on socket. Need to measure length of the end check valve from end of ferrule. Require length is 31.5 mm for model HB15T. After correct length of check valve is adjusted, mount mixer on ferrule and tighten. And then, tighten lock screws on mixer. Mount cap on mixer and tighten it. As like before, don't forget to set lock screws on cap. If burner is not used for long time, should wrap with plastic and cover from dust and foreign particles. Okay, let's mount burners on baffle plate. Insert main burner nozzle pipe into its guide pipe.
and then, secure nozzle pipe with hexagonal socket set bolts. Connect compressed air hose to main burner. And then, connect steam hose to main burner. Connect fuel oil inlet quick coupler of main burner. Mount pilot burner into nozzle pipe. Secure pilot burner with baffle plate by butterfly nuts. Connect plugs to electrodes. As last, connect diesel oil inlet coupler to pilot burner. Don't forget to mount flame eye sensor. Thanks for watching till the end of video. Please don't forget like and subscribe channel.